Hey guys, welcome back to my kitchen. Today I'm gonna show you guys how to make dry mango paste. It's one of my favorite desserts. If you have many of mango and want to keep it more longer, it's easy to store for a month if you make this dessert. This dessert is natural, it's known as sugar, it has low calorie, and it's excellent snack during travel, and it's very good taste. First, we just peel the mango and then make to be the little pieces. And then we're gonna put the mango into the blender and blend it through until it's smooth paste. And here is the mango puree and then we gonna make in the next step. And then we gonna put the mango puree into the pot. For this recipe, I used one and half kilogram of the mango, and then add some tamarind juice, one tablespoon. This one is just option if you want a bit of sour, you can add. But if you want only sweet taste, you just use the mango, and then add a bit of salt, quarter tablespoon. And then mix it well and put into the heat and use low heat and stir continuously. It will take about 20 or 25 minutes for cooking. Not, not make it more time because it make it more dry. And now it's ready. I use for uh, 25 minutes and then let it cool down. Not really cool but just only warm. And then spread into the plate. Just make sure you spread it evenly and not too thick. The thicken is the longer it will take to dehydrate. So this recipe I will use two, two types of the mango mango 
paste one is uh, I will make like a rose and then we need to cover all the plate and another one is just roll it we just make like a small circle like this If you want to peel it's very easy you just put on the plastic And then let's dry under the sun for one day. And now it's ready for our dry mango paste. It's so nice and so good taste. So and then we will remove it. The first first type is uh, we just roll it that we make like a circle as beginning and then roll it You can get the dry mango paste and continue to do until it's finished. The next one we are gonna do like a rose dry mango just make to be the the line for one inch per inch just cut the sheet into the wrong strip like this and then we will roll it like to be like a rose this one is you just roll it in the beginning and then or uh, turn it out and roll it. For this step, you just make sure that your hand is clean or you can use a cloth to protect for the cleanness.
And now it's ready for our dry mango paste. You can apply this into the roast or into the roll. It depends on what you like. It's very easy and you keep it more long time. You can keep in the container in the refrigerator um, for months for months or keep in outside is it's okay. So I hope you guys give this try for this recipe and if you like this recipe please like subscribe and follow me on my YouTube and my Facebook and see you next time.